Hi, my name is Jackie and welcome back to my channel. I am here again today with another Adagio Teas review. And this time um, it is for the Lychee Rose Green Tea. Um, and this is part of the, uh, back in, back at the end of last year, they released a poll. I've said this like a bajillion times now, but they, they had a poll um, to allow Adagio Tea fans to select the new tea flavor. And the choices were between the, uh, Pecan rooibos turtle, the um, blackberry sage oolong, and then this lychee rose green. And I've done reviews for the other two teas, which I will link to in case you have not seen them already. Spoiler, the pecan rooibos turtle was amazing. Um, the oolong, the blackberry sage oolong was just so-so, um, in my opinion. I mean, it was an interesting flavor combination to me, but I don't know if I would necessarily go out of my way to purchase it again. Today I'm tasting the lychee rose green tea, and this is actually the tea that I voted for. So the ingredients in this are green tea, apple pieces, rose petals, lychee flavor, and rose flavor. So I'm gonna go ahead and give it a sniff. Oh wow, that is a very, very, very fragrant. Like I don't even have it up to my nose and I can already smell it. So I guess first and foremost, uh, if you've never had a lychee before, you're probably like, what is this thing? Um, but it is a fruit that is uh, found in in uh, Asia, like I think maybe Southeast Asia. They're, they're pretty small, maybe the size of a cherry. And the outside skin that you peel off is sort of like this spiky pink thing. And then on the inside is this like really fleshy grape type fruit. Um, and on the inside there's like this really hard pit that you have to, that you you know, eat around or pull out. Um, but the flavor of it is sort of floral, like this really juicy floral flavor. And it's delicious. This smells like a lychee flavored gummy fruit snack, um, which, uh, where, I mean, I had, so my brother used to live in Japan uh, cause he was in the Air Force and he had sent me some lychee flavored gummy snacks um, and so that's sort of what this reminds me of sort of that artificial lychee scent that is in a in a fruit snack it's it's a lot more appealing than it sounds um, and I definitely smell the rose as well I'm gonna say that the floral aroma of the lychee and then the rose uh, flavors are gonna probably work pretty well together because they're kind of similar. I don't really smell the green tea in this It's it's mostly rose and the lychee flavoring that I smell and this is what the tea looks like I think this is a really beautiful blend uh, You have some beautiful green well green tea and then you just have these beautiful pink Rose petals in here dried rose petals that I think I just think this is a really beautiful looking tea And then these chunks in here are apple pieces I'm very excited to try this. It brews up to a light yellow color. The, the aroma of the brewed tea is pretty similar to the aroma of the dried tea leaves. It smells like rose, but also like that lychee fruit gummy flavor or that fruit gummy scent. I like it. So I don't know if the flavor of the green tea really stands out to me. What I mostly taste is sort of like this ambiguous floral flavor at the beginning. There's nothing about it that says, wow, this is lychee, or wow, this is rose. Um, it's just sort of like this nice, subtle floral flavor. And then as it like sits on your tongue for a little, a little while, then like this very distinct, like sweet rose flavor starts to surface. And I really like it. It's not the kind of rose that just sort of like attacks your tongue is like and is like overly perfumey and just sort of like ugh. it's it's actually really sweet and subtle and I really like that. That's that's really great. This is, this is a really pleasant tea. Um, I'm gonna say they probably. I'm gonna say I'm gonna say the voters were right though like the tea the best tea of these three is definitely that pecan rooibos turtle or the rooibos pecan turtle I keep calling it the wrong thing 
definitely the, the, the better of the three is that rooibos pecan turtle. Like that is just an exceptional tea to me. I just, I love the caramel flavors. I love the nutty flavors. I love the chocolate flavor. I mean, surprisingly, I really love that chocolate flavor. I'm gonna say the second one is this beautiful lychee rose green tea. Um, the, the green tea doesn't really stand out to me, but I really do like the subtle floral flavors. You know, sometimes when you drink a floral tea, like it's just, it just is, it's intense and, and, and the floral flavors can be overly perfumey, but, but this is just a really delicate tea. Like this is a really beautiful tea. I really appreciate this. I really appreciate this. And then I would say the last of the three, my, my least favorite, or my third favorite, I guess depending on how you look at it, is the um, the blackberry sage oolong. You've definitely tasted the sage in it, but I kind of felt like the blackberry the blackberry flavors were lacking. Um, I just think that the lychee rose green tea and the uh, rooibos pecan turtle were such great teas. Um, I would definitely recommend this one. I definitely would. If, if rose, if you like the rose flavors, the floral flavors, I think you're definitely going to like this. This is, this is a, a, a pretty delicate tea. This is, I, I am, I am, pardon me for a moment. I am just, it's just lovely. I'm sorry, there's a whole bunch of glare going on in my glasses right now. I wish I, I, wish I wasn't such a four eyes right now. <sighs> so that's the end of this video. I hope you enjoyed it. Um, if you've tried the lychee rose green tea, what are your thoughts about it? And if you've tried the, the uh, three other teas, or I guess the three teas um, that were part of this poll, the rooibos pecan turtle, the blackberry sage oolong, this lychee rose green tea, which of them were your favorite? I'd love to know. Just leave me a comment below. If you appreciated this video and you're interested in more tea-related content in the future, please consider liking and subscribing, and I hope to see you guys again in the future. Bye!